fucking ate him? Howdy folks, welcome on back to You, Me, and the Movies, or tonight, You, Me, and the TV, and we're starting our second TV show here, It's Lost. Alright. Created by J.J. Abrams, he directs the first two episodes, the pilot episode. What do you know about Lost? What do you know about it? Uh, it's about like a plane that gets lost, it gets crash lands or something on a deserted island, and they're just, they're lost on this island. I'm not super excited about this show it was on it was like a big deal when i was in high school and college and my college roommate watched it which was totally fine but i and i so but i never watched it with her and i just have no real interest in it yeah. i'm hopeful that this will change my mind it's got great characters that's what this show is about it's a great ensemble cast there's a bunch of different characters because it's a whole plane full right landing on right. the island so we get to learn about a bunch of different characters and, and these survivors and they try to work together on this island so i think you'll like that because i think you like character driven tv shows all right well we'll see i'm i have i doubt that it will be able to be as good as dexter in my yeah. mind because i'm really enjoying dexter yeah. but we'll see gotta right. give it a shot well let's jump right in but first but first like, comment, and subscribe. Yep. Give us a thumbs up. And come join the movies family. Yep. Check out our Patreon. The link's down below if you want to get access to full-length reactions, early access to some of our videos. But All let's right. jump into it. Let's check out Lost. Here we go. I worry it's going to be like a Langoliers sort of situation. We'll find out. Langoliers always scared me. Oh, a puppy. What's with the screaming? Hmm. There we go. Uh oh. What good is screaming gonna do? How is the engine still going? Well, the engine stopped. <laughs> hey, you! Come here! I need to get this woman away from these fumes. Is he a doctor? He must be a doctor. Stop! Her head's not tilted far back enough. You're blowing air into her stomach. Maybe we should do one of those whole things. Maybe we stick the pen on the throat. <laughs> yeah, good idea. You go get me a pen. Jesus, what a show. This guy's like cool as a cucumber. You're like, whoa, scary. <laughs> Stay with her. Dude, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> He's had enough. <laughs> I didn't get to finish my thought about the woman he gave CPR to. Yeah, like, what was it? She's going to have, like, the worst farts later. <laughs> her stomach is full of air from that other guy blowing air into her stomach. <laughs> she's going to be just farting up a storm. <laughs> They're all good. Thanks. She looks like Superman. Him? Oh, yeah. he's the guy from Vampire Diaries. Yeah, he's from Vampire Diaries. I never watched it. I did. It's very good. <laughs> of course you did. He's gonna, like, sew himself up or something. He's got a huge gash. It's 
wasn't a great idea to like hang his clothes on the branch, but he put the cloth that he's gonna use to clean it with on the on the sand. Whatever. How's he gonna reach that? Did you ever patch a pair of jeans? I made the drapes in my apartment. That's fantastic. Listen, do you have a second? I could use a little help here. Yeah, she's got some time. But I just can't you reach it. You to sew that up. It's just like the drapes, same no, thing. No, with the drapes, it's a sewing machine. No, you can Just do a little whip stitch. You'll be fine. Recognize him? From this show. Right, like he's this made him pretty popular. Yeah, he's in the last season of Yellowstone. Yellowstone, yeah. Is he like the antagonist of this show? Let's watch and find out. That would suck. And the nerves just spilled out of her like angel hair pasta. Spinal fluid flowing out of her. And I... Ooh, that's graphic. Let it take over. Let it do its thing. But only for five seconds. That's all I was going to give it. Four, five, and it was gone. I have to try that. You'd think they would have come by now. Who? Anyone. I'll eat on the rescue boat. I'll eat on the rescue boat. Oh, I'm going to love her. I can already tell. Well, hang in there. Yeah, you too. He's gonna be that baby's daddy. Do you think he's gonna live? No way. And then the the front end of the plane broke off. Well, it's not here on the beach. Neither is the tail. So this is just the middle. People just in the middle of the plane. Is there monsters in this place? Did anybody see that? What the hell? Are there scary things in this forest? I was hoping for like a castaway sort of situation. Terrific. <laughs> He's like Dexter. <laughs> cool. <laughs> or yes, you would say super. Yeah, super. Mostly vodka. Excuse me. Sir, excuse me. Guess he really had to go. <laughs> it's gonna be over. Oh, Jesus. Ew. I feel like we'll be war- We'll be- What? Gonna be flying on any planes anytime soon. <laughs> what the thing in the woods didn't do anything? Just came and did weird shit and then didn't kill anyone? It's a weird thing. <laughs> She's making the same face she is. <laughs> like, what the hell? Grim in there. You think we should do something about the, uh... B-O-D-Y-S? <laughs> what are you spelling, man? Bodies? B-O-D-I-E-S. <laughs> that sounds like a good idea. No, they'll deal with it when they get here. I'm gonna go out and look for the cockpit. Have you ever heard of drive shafts? You all, everybody! You all, everybody! We gotta keep moving. <laughs> the puppy again. You 
guys, is this normal? Day turning into night, you know, end of the world type weather. Is this... Guys? Is it his wife or his sister? There it is again. They left themselves like little breadcrumbs to get back. You okay? Should have warned him. Flying bodies. So, what does a transceiver look like? A complicated walkie talkie. <laughs> Jesus. Are you think he's a wife? Can you hear me? <coughs> How many survive? At least 48. They're looking for us. In the wrong place. <laughs> Where's Charlie? <gasps> Charlie's a bit of a weirdo, yeah? He's gonna be, like, up to shady stuff. Charlie? What the f dude? What are you doing in the bathroom? What? <sighs> what the hell was that? The jungle does weird things. How many seasons are we gonna go through not knowing what this thing is? All all of the seasons? Can't answer that. I'm going to be really annoyed if we have to go all of the seasons not knowing what the hell this is. Why? You just f***ing ate him? What the hell? Are you gonna try to run? I feel like that's a bad idea. Hey, Karumba. Hey, ah, ah, ah. Where the hell's you? I don't know. Did you see I wasn't, and, and then Jack came back and he, and he pulled me up. I don't know where he is. something like that happen is it the predator thoughts questions what well, i know you have questions so many thoughts. questions <laughs> no i feel like i know like just enough about kind of what lost is to know that there's something on the island that they're that's f***ing around with them like an Acme sort of situation. I can't remember what it's Acme. called. What the company's called, okay. right? I recall some pop cultural references to, like, cans of soup with oh, their name okay. on it. I can't remember what the group is called. We'll so. get there soon enough. But this is weird. This is, like, paranormal meets monster, but an invisible monster like the Predator. So <laughs> I'm not sure what to think, to be honest. So, uh, how... I other than thoughts, like, how are you liking it so far? Skeptical about Charlie. Yeah. 
he seems like so we've really meet we've met three characters like charlie jack and kate are kind of the, yeah the lead right now you're, obviously you're skeptical of charlie obviously jack is going to be your protagonist during yeah, this yeah. whole thing so somebody's got to be the antagonist mm-hmm. i'm assuming at this point it's charlie but i don't okay. know right. so, it seems like there could be a couple protagonists mm-hmm. or i mean antagonists like the bald guy that looks like creed kind of what's his name the one we oh. haven't actually met yet we just met yet. Seen i don't want to reveal names until you okay. find out about him. he seems weird too okay I just keep imagining that all of the weird people are probably weird. antagonists of some yeah. kind. What about Kate? You you recognize her from she plays the Wasp in the Ant Man movies, right? Oh, that's what she's from. You, you didn't realize that? No, I was like, gosh, she looks familiar. Yeah, this was uh, what, what's her name? Ange- Evan- Angeline, Evan- Evangeline, Evangeline Lilly. Lilly. Yeah. This was her breakout role. Okay. So she looks great. Yeah. Um, I I she's gonna be protagonist like Jack, right? Yeah. Sort of. Hmm. No, I'm. I'm a, interested in seeing how it continues to develop. I don't like this monster. Yeah. It's all the that the I first know. two episodes are directed by J.J. Abrams, who, who's made Cloverfield and the Star Wars uh, yeah, he does sequels. He did weird, scary Force monsters. Awakens and Rise of Skywalker. Okay. So just some of the movies I know you've seen of his. Right. Right. Well, let's jump into episode two of Lost, the second half of the pilot. What were you doing in the bathroom? I thought you could tell. Looking for, looking for drugs or something. He's like an addict or something, and. Excuse me. So excuse me. Mm-hmm. Sir, are you all right? It's like chicken bouillon. Really? Hey, we're going through some clothes, sorting them. See you found your bag. (laughs) Come on, you want to give us a hand? Not really. No, she's useless. Is that your boyfriend? My brother, Boone. Uh Oh. God's friggin' gift to humanity. I haven't felt the baby move since yesterday. Mm. Vincent! Oh, it's his dog. What is this? I just found him. Yeah, it could be nothing. Could just be like the air marshal had a pair on him when he... Shoot this, buddy! What is going on? Get off! Come on! Bring it! Stop! Hurley. Oh, just... Say it. I could never make a messy bun work. (laughs) Just did not have the hands for it, I guess. There is one thing we could try. What? Seeing if we can get a signal from high ground. How high? Yeah, through the creepy forest part of this situation. Jungle? Forest? Whatever. Yeah, it's way up there. Wait for me. I don't know how long it's going to said the battery won't last. Turn it off and then turn it back on. Starving? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm nowhere near that hungry. (laughs) No, no thank you. No way, no. <laughs> Tell you what, we get home, get you another dog. He doesn't want another dog. He wants his dog. You're going, are you? Yeah, are you? Yep. Yeah, I'm definitely going. Look, every- Party of four. You couldn't tell from that that she's actually really nice. <laughs> Did his girlfriend break up with him before he went on that plane? Oh, party of five. They're taking off five of them. Hope they can run fast. Actually six, but... He just 
decided to go. Less like a hike, more like a free climb or something. What is it like, checkers? Not really. It's a better game than checkers. I've always wondered how to play backgammon. You ever played it? I think I played it like once or twice, but I have to read the instructions all over again to mm -hmm. remember how. She got sick. She died a couple of weeks ago. You're having a bad month. I guess. Backgammon's the oldest game in the world. Archaeologists found sets when they excavated the ruins of ancient Mesopotamia. Hmm. Whoa. Do you want to know a secret? That was creepy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I think you're a he. I'm not asking you to keep it on all day. We're still blocked by the mountain. Just check the damn radio! We might just check! We might not have any juice left when we get to... What the hell's that? Sorry's coming. Run. I shouldn't have come on this! No sh How the hell does he have a gun? Oh. Was it like a fucking polar bear? It's a polar bear. It's a polar bear. That's weird. <laughs> hey, guy, you awake? <laughs> Yo, there's a rescue plane. We're saved. Yay! <laughs> yeah, hey. He's out. Hey, hey, you. <laughs> Wake up. I'm not so good around blood. Just do the best you can, okay? <laughs> What's going on? The strips, just hand me the strips. Give it to me. Don't even think it. Hurley, hey! Damn it! Probably won't be moving anytime soon. <laughs> no, polar bears don't live near this far south. This one does. Did. It did. I don't feel like you'd really be able to kill a polar bear with a handgun. How the hell do I know? About the bear, the gun. U.S. Marshal had a gun. That's where the handcuffs People don't came carry from. guns on planes. They do if they're a U.S. Marshal, sweet cheeks. There was one on the plane. So I took the gun. Thought it might come in handy. Guess what? I just shot a bear. <laughs> you found the gun on a U.S. Marshal? Because yes. you were the one he was bringing back to the States. Yeah, you are the prisoner. Fine. I'm the criminal. I know firsthand that... U.S. Marshals don't necessarily escort prisoners. They have made constant flights on, like, international trips, very popular trips mm -hmm. since 9-11, maybe even before. My cousin's one. Yeah, even with girls like you. My girl's exactly like me. Did she say no girl's exactly like me? Can I get you a refill? No, I'm I'm fine with this. Thank you. She the prisoner? Ah, oh, yeah. Interesting. Interesting. Your hands cuffed wouldn't prohibit She's you from doing that. She's handcuffed to the seat too. Oh, oh, gotcha. Okay, I was like, ah, uh, come on. <laughs> Just reach. This is why we wear our seatbelts, folks. We should keep moving. Click it or tick it. Oh. 
Mayday, Mayday! What is that? Feedback. Feedback from what? What would do that? I don't know. I'll transmit it from where? What? Somewhere close. The signal's strong. That giant Somewhere cliff behind you. The French! The French are coming! I've never been so happy to hear the French! <laughs> does anyone speak French? She does. What, what are you I... talking about? You spent a year in Paris? Drinking, not studying! Iteration 7, 2, 9, 4, 5, 3, Okay, one. what's that? They're dead. It, it killed them. It, it killed them all. Sixteen years and five months. That's the count. What the hell are you talking? It's been going for sixteen years. Someone else was stranded here. It's a pretty up island. Guys. Where are we? Hell. So what do you think? Hmm. Where are they? Some hell island. Some hell island. So there's a polar bear there. Yep. How the hell did it get there? Earlier, uh, Walt, the little boy, mm -hmm. was reading a comic book. Right. There was a polar bear in the comic book, too. Ooh. Mm. So. Foreshadowing. Uh, interesting uh, part about the original pilot script when J.J. Abrams, Jack was supposed to die. Oh, well, I'm glad he didn't. But they like Matthew Fox so much and his portrayal of Jack that... Yeah, his character is the did, best one so far. They wanted to have, like, the main character mm -hmm. die in the... Like, you follow him for the whole episode and then, and then he, he was dies. supposed to get eaten by the monster on the pilot. So that would have been a lot like Game of Thrones style. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was supposed to be like a big, you know, twist. And you're like, I like this guy. Oh, he's dead. Super. But, uh, they kept Matthew Fox on it, obviously. Yeah. He's alive at least two episodes now, so. <laughs> right. <laughs> Learn a little bit more about Charlie and Kate this episode. Mm -hmm. right? Charlie's an addict. Yeah, and Kate is a prisoner. Mm -hmm. She was a criminal being taken back to the States yeah. by a U.S. Marshal. Was that what you were, I mean, you kind of... In my mind, out Charlie a little bit. In my mind, her. she's like Amanda Knox or something, right? Like, <laughs> Who's that? The one that was like overseas studying abroad and like got it, killed her boyfriend. Oh, okay. Or they... You think she's like that? Or or they... Like um, murder? Falsely accused her yeah. of murdering okay. her boyfriend or something like that. So you think that's what Kate did? Something no, like I don't know. In my mind, <laughs> I feel like maybe. All right. We also learned uh, a little bit more about Saeed. Well, he was kind of introduced here, mm -hmm. and Sawyer, and they were kind of at arms. Well, I'm going to dislike Sawyer for a while, I think, just because mm -hmm. his character is abrasive. Yeah. But that's the point. Yeah. Um, I'm sure he'll get better. Harley's probably my favorite so Harley's far. Harley's your favorite, so, yeah. Harley's, like, I think a fan favorite. everyone's favorite for the yeah. show, because he's just... He's he lighthearted. Can't, he can't, he can't not like Harley. Yeah. He's just, he's kind of like the comic relief, and he's always happy to see everybody, and it's fun, so... Yeah. So... All right, we're two episodes in. Are you hooked now? Or are you kind of like, okay, I'm not what's hooked the, yet. You want you want a couple more episodes? I want to know like, what's happening, but <laughs> okay. I'm not like like if I she, stopped. She wants to know what's happening. But if I lost, if I st I, know, I won't ever know what's happening <laughs> in Lost. Um, if I stopped now, I wouldn't be like, oh my gosh, I wonder what's happening in Lost. No. I'd just be like, yeah, it's over. I'm fine but with that. Are you enjoying it so far? Sure. 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 Is it better than you thought it would be? No. No, it's what you, expectations. Yeah, right. it's pretty much meeting my expectations right. at this point. Tell us what who your favorite character is from Lost. Mm -hmm. Let me know why I should like Lost more than I am right yeah, now. Let us know why you think she should like Lost without getting into spoilers. Of course. Right? Yeah. And let us know your favorite character from the first season of Lost. Right? Are there new characters in future seasons? We'll find out. They're lost on an island. How many new characters could be introduced? Comment, like, subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. It's a good thumbs up, right? Looks just like yep. the picture. Yep. Thumbs it up. Join us on Patreon if you're interested. Yep. On Patreon links down below. On exclusive content mm -hmm. and uh, new re early releases. Early releases and full-length reactions. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.
any kind of look at it? No. Bullshit. Could give a really graphic description of it. Would be great. Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the TV. Today we get back to the island and we're watching some more Lost Season 1. Oof. What happened last time we were on the island? Do you remember? Plane crashed, big invisible monster, polar bear of some kind, radio signal that's been there for 16 years, and a uh, big monster again. We have some details about Jack. What is Jack? Jack's a doctor. Uh -huh. Kate is a criminal of some sort. <laughs> she was on the plane with an... A U.S. Marshal. Mm -hmm. What are you hoping to learn tonight? Well, I guess episodes. more some more character development. Mm -hmm. I would love to know what the thing is. The thing. But I have a feeling I'm never gonna know. She's never gonna know. Or is she? Guess we'll have to find out. It'd be great. I would also love for the boy to find his dog. Well, yep. yeah. That would be nice. All right. Well, let's jump into it. But first, like, comment, subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Come hang out. You'll, mm -hmm. you'll like it. Sure. Yeah. And check out our Patreon if you want early access to all our videos we upload on YouTube a week before they hit YouTube, as well as full-length movie reactions and more. Full right? length. Check it out. The link's down below. Let's watch some Lost. Let's do it. My jacket pocket. My jacket pocket. Okay. Oh, sh dangerous. She's dangerous. How dangerous could she be? What is she like? The Black Widow? She like eat men for breakfast. What's her deal? <laughs> like, how dangerous could she be? I let her eat me for breakfast. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Walked right into that one. Man, Sawyer, Said's right. You keep walking, you're not gonna make it to the beach. Yeah, why is that? She's seen it. Satellites can shoot, but they must be told where to point. Oh. Bollocks. Yeah. <laughs> to relay what we heard, without fully understanding it, will cause a panic. If we tell them what we know, we take away their hope. And hope is a very dangerous thing to lose. So we lie. You just omit the truth. It's not technically lying. Just don't tell them the whole story. So how do you know it wasn't a dinosaur? Because dinosaurs are extinct. <laughs> oh. Dying. He's not gonna die. He's yellow, man. His wound is infected, but the antibiotics will fight it off. What if they don't? Then he'll die. What's this? Uh, dude? Uh, Should have hid that better, Jack. <laughs> what do you think she did? It's none of my business. She looks pretty hardcore. Early. <laughs> She's like secretly like a serial killer or something. <laughs> no, she's not a serial killer. She's not a serial killer. Can't be. She exhibits none of the other personality traits. She's oh, give it marches. back to me. Oh, yeah, give it to Al Jazeera. He'll protect Al Jazeera's a network. I'll keep the damn gun. We should give it to her. <laughs> yeah. Kate should hold the gun. Fine with me. She's like the most dangerous of all of them. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know why, but... <laughs> oh, good. Some backstory. Good How'd you get here? What? You walked? Yeah. From where? Town. Nearest town's 15 kilometers. Maybe that's why I'm so exhausted. It was a distress call from a French woman. She said that the others were dead. That something had killed them all. She was alone on the island. It's been playing for 16 years, Jack. It's like the Bermuda Triangle of islands, right? <laughs> No. 
could just ask, right? Like, what's it gonna hurt to ask? She's in that mugshot, and now we found those handcuffs. And that guy keeps mumbling, she's dangerous, she's dangerous, over and over. <laughs> the bodies are in there, and they're all dead. Look, I'll handle it. Why don't you keep an eye like, on it? Yeah, I'd love to on it. <laughs> He's such like a chicken sh Boo. Creeper. You do this back home, too? Steal from the dead? Brother, you gotta you should really take everything out, inventory all of it, right? I mean, those pills you're gonna use to fix them up. As many as it takes, yeah. How I many you got? You're just not looking at the big picture, Doc. I'm with Sawyer on this one. Check you out. Yeah, she feels so loved. We haven't met. I'm Kate. Hi, Kate. Hi. Hurley. <laughs> We're on the fuselage? What? Yeah, in, yeah, in the, uh, 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 you know, I, I gotta go get that water. <laughs> <laughs> so awkward. <laughs> Yeah, collect all the water you can. Is she gonna try to kill him? Everywhere. Damn right they do. What are you looking for, Ray? What? He's turning her in. Rude. Mr. Locke said a miracle happened. Yeah, well, a miracle happened to all of us, Walt. We survived the plane crash. But like, I don't want you hanging around him anymore. Why not? He's my friend. Because he's weird. He says weird to little kids. <laughs> you don't care about Vincent. I'm going to get your dog back as soon as it stops raining. Hey, listen to me. I'm going to get your dog back. The rain just turns on and off like a switch there. It's so weird. Like somebody's literally flipping a switch. Walking through the haunted damn jungle, looking for your... Might find a polar bear. Careful. Vincent. That you, buddy? Dogs don't make that noise, dude. Oopsie. Oh. Something was uh chasing me, so uh turn around. Turn around. <laughs> yeah, I don't hear it now. Uh but you you should probably uh Turn around, dude. I, I, I didn't see anything. Uh, you know, uh, if, if you're worried about it, I, I, I didn't see anything. I used some tribal flukes once in a recording session. Is he making a dog whistle? Call the dog back? I wish he would just die already. Real humane, Shan. <laughs> Trying to save his life. Puma has it you can't. Yeah, it's not more humane to let him suffer. What did she do? I want to talk to her. Tell me what she did. I want to talk to her alone. He seems like a psycho ex-husband to me. Hmm? And he's just trying to play her off as dangerous to keep control of her. I 
great to kill the man now. She sounds like, oh god. <laughs> I thought she was like in the road. Hey, Kate. So, where's the fugitive? In the tent. Let her in there alone? What's she gonna do? 120 pounds soaking wet. Yeah, but she's got that gun. Oh, man, I saw it in her, in her, in her, in her. Kate. Yeah. Oh. What did you do? What you couldn't. <coughs> oh, you didn't even do it right. Oh, no way. <laughs> you shot him in the chest? I was aiming for his heart. You missed. Man, is he still breathing? You perforated his lung. It'll take hours to bleed out. I only had one bullet. Get out. Get out! Oops. Damn it! Dog whistle. tell you what I did, why he was after me. I don't want to know. It doesn't matter, Kate. Three days ago, we all died. We should all be able to start over. So we're never gonna know? Hmm. trying to make us hate him he seems to be nice enough all right tabula rasa down we learned a little bit more about kate this episode uh kind of not really she was on the run she got turned in basically. from what we don't know what jack's like i don't want to know it doesn't matter anymore i want to know <laughs> i'd like to know what she did <laughs> whatever it's not about me i guess what are your thoughts after this episode no thoughts yeah. Good character development, so let's just keep that rolling into the next one. Alright, well let's jump on in. Perfect, well I get Episode it. Episode 4. Alright, some backstory on this fella. What's his name again? Locke. Locke. Mr. Locke. Keep wanting to call him Creed, I know that's not right. Hey, what? You gotta keep that dog quiet. I don't know what's wrong with him. Come on, Vincy, get that out! He's a good guard dog. What is it? There's somebody's in there. Sawyer, right behind you, jackass. It's a bear eating the dead bodies. Duh. Another good reason why they should have removed the bodies and moved them elsewhere. Freaking lion? I'm gonna shed some light on. No. Freaking wild boars. No, bears. What the hell well, were those? Boars. They were wild boars? Yeah. Boars. Yeah, you can kill one, you could eat it. Yeah, it's food. Don't get gored, though. Yeah, I mean, you gotta, like, get the right sort of utensil. Utensil. Weapon. Yeah. <laughs> need the right kind of utensil to eat it, too, I suppose. We don't have time to sort out everybody's got. Really? Last I heard, we were positively made of time. Look, I'm not happy about it, either. I mean, maybe they'll get lucky and some of their wishes would be to be cremated. <laughs> What's going on? Jethro here's hoarding the last of the peanuts. My own stash. I found it in there. What about the rest of the food? There is no rest of the food, dude. We kind of ate it all. Okay, everybody, just calm down. 
Get good at fishing and hunting. There are plenty of things on this island we can use for sustenance. And exactly how are we going to find the sustenance? We hunt. Jesus. <laughs> okay, Mr. Locke, what is it that we're hunting? Boar, duh. On the island? Razorbacks by the look of them. The ones that came into the camp last night were piglets. Boar's usual mode of attack is to circle around, charge from behind, so I figure it'll take at least three of us to distract her long enough for me to flank one of the piglets, pin it, and slit his throat. And you gave him his knife back? <laughs> well, if you've got a better idea. He's a collector. <laughs> Who is this guy? <laughs> yes. Colonel Locke, is this line secure? Line secure GL-12, go ahead. Is he an assassin? In a 10 key with his left hand? Sorry, I don't understand, but... You're cool with this, right? Uh, 네. I don't need a babysitter. Come on, man. Vincent needs you here. 너무 걱정하지 마. 아버지 괜찮으실 거야. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> whatever you said. Yeah, well, we should have to worry about starving when we take you care of I'm not going to starve. Right. What are you going to eat? Oceans full of fish. You got to catch them. They don't just come to you. Card. You really don't think I can catch a fish? I'd be pretty willing to bet she couldn't catch a fish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this was gonna come up. Yes, I am the bass guitarist. Yeah, do you know but... anything about fishing? What? F fishing? <laughs> yeah, I'm like a, I'm a, I'm a fishing fiend. You know, I mean, England's an island, so I just throw it in and fish. <laughs> What does the mom do when you slit the baby's throat, though? Imagine she gets pretty mad. Oh, they're trying to look for mama. Are they trying to slit the mom's throat? Mm-hmm. Hey, quick, giving us the steal signal. Dummy. Move. Your troops are across enemy lines. Patience. Oh. <laughs> Not an assassin. Just don't tell me what I can't do. John. Uh -uh. Michael's hurt. We have to get him back to camp. Yeah, you take him back to camp. I'm gonna get that for I'm fine, I can do this. John, you can't. Don't tell me what I can't do. Does he have a fake leg or something? Dude, quit asking me that. <laughs> Never had to try a poke on with a sharp stick. <laughs> wow. Son of a you want me to have a go? <laughs> I hope he gets his board. Eight months. I'm not allowed to meet customers. Um. Uh, uh, look, I don't care about the money. I just Helen, Helen. He oh boy.
really, really not going to give it to us from his perspective. God damn it. So it was like a boar fight? Not so much a fight. It was more, you know, like me getting gored. Yeah, just boar goring. I don't think the hunt went very well. The bald guy never came back. Wait, they didn't bring back any food at all? Did you hear what I said? He doesn't do something. There you are. As promised, you and I will be dining on fresh cat. You got a fish. Little brain. You think this proves that you can take care of yourself? I told you I'd catch a fish, didn't I? She That's can manipulate other people into taking care of her. That's kind of like taking care of yourself. Oh, man. Maybe if you wanted to say something, you know, about your husband. What? I'm just saying if you wanted to say goodbye to Bernard. Doctor. My husband is not dead. Rose, he was in the tail section of the plane. It broke off in mid-flight. I'm sorry, but everyone who was in the rear of the plane is gone. They're probably thinking the same thing about us. Oh god, that's creepy. Doctor? So like his dead father or something. You coming? Yeah, he's got to be hallucinating, right? Oh gosh, why is he got to be creepy now? Lock. Lock's gone. You don't know that. You didn't see him die. How psyched is everyone gonna be when he comes back with a boar? <laughs> I just don't think they're ready to hear about some things. Like what the hell? Is he like dehydrated and now just kind of hallucinating? Fuck. So that thing, the. Monster, whatever. She said it was headed right towards you. Did you see anything? You get any kind of look at it? No. Bullshit. Why wouldn't he share that? Could give a really graphic description of it. It would be great. <laughs> <laughs> it's a based on no, I, I don't want to go back to Sydney. Look, I've been preparing for this for years. Just put me on the bus right now. I can do this. No, you can't. Hey, hey, don't you walk away from me. You don't know who you're dealing with. Don't ever tell me what I can't do, ever. This is destiny. This is destiny. This is, this is my destiny. This is, I'm supposed to do this, damn it. Don't tell me what I can't do. Don't tell me what I can't do. That's the miracle. He can walk. Wow. Wow. Miracle for sure. However, he was a paraplegic for eight years. Mm -hmm. There's no way he'd be able to actually walk. He'd have no muscle in his leg to be able to actually. I mean, unless that's part of the miracle, I guess. <laughs> Just all of a sudden has. Well, it's four years. Four years. What what oh, four office. years. Four years. So, yeah. Locke was in a wheelchair, and now he's walking around. So, that was the revelation. That this episode was called Walkabout for the. Obviously, he was going to Australia to do one, but yeah. kind of the, the double meaning of that with his character and stuff. So, so we learned about mysterious Mister Luck, who yeah. was kind of creepy the first three, yeah. three episodes. Yeah, I'm a little disappointed we haven't learned any more about Jack's backstory, yeah. but I imagine with the aberrations he's been seeing, yeah, we'll, I feel we'll like we'll they're setting up for that. the next episode. Yeah, must yeah. be. They kind of sprinkle in like last episode was. Why is Locke being so creepy? Oh, yeah, this here's is why. A, here's a little bit more about him, right? Yeah. Do you think Locke saw the monster? Are you just yeah, no, him? I think Locke saw the yeah. monster. I think he so. came face to face with it, and that monster was like, I don't know if he freaked it out or <laughs> with maybe his creepiness. Or... Maybe he doesn't see it as a monster since 
he's had this spiritual awakening kind of thing with the island that uh i guess he's like this place is awesome <laughs> don't know why it would uh not kill him right who knows that's part of the mystery isn't it exactly right, uh, i'm getting more interested in in the show in the show so that's a little bit more hooked that's on it. good yeah it's Catching me a little bit more. So you learned about the format of the show. Yeah, this is going to be the format going forward because the pilot was kind of just like For flashbacks the next to six just the crash. Seasons. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> It'll focus on one character. Yeah, kind of build character kind of do development. A little backstory on them. Mm -hmm. So perfect. Yeah. Who have you seen? They're like, okay, when's their episode going to come? Other than Jack, of course. Cause yeah, he's... Jack. Interested in Sawyer, mm -hmm. interested in Saeed. Saeed. Yeah. yeah. We saw a picture, Saeed's picture. Yeah, exactly. Right? So. He found a picture of a, a lady. It looked like he probably a you know, love interest yeah. of his or something. Mm -hmm. Sawyer don't really know anything about exactly. other than he's kind of a... I'd imagine so. his backstory will come back, come by a little bit later. Yeah. Uh, Locke has definitely been doing a lot of studying mm -hmm. and, and planning in the time that he's been stuck in his bed. Yeah. Preparing for... For a miracle. Maybe this. Yeah. Coming to this island. Maybe. Exactly. Yeah. So. It's all in his cards, I guess. So I think that's one thing I think you're going to like about Lost is you can kind of see that with this episode is kind of fate and coincidence. Mm -hmm. I mean, Charlie was writing fate on his... Yeah. And then he changed it to late because nobody showed up. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Kind of with Locke, you kind of get the hint to that mm -hmm. is maybe he went to Australia to get onto this plane. Right. Not to go on the walkabout. His actual walkabout was, was this, was this yeah. right? Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Absolutely. So, there's some deeper meaning in the in this episode right here that I think is foreshadowing for what you can expect going forward. So cool, I like it. All right. So anything else you want to say? Uh, I'd like to know in the comments what everybody's favorite character, who who everybody's favorite character is, mm -hmm. um, and why. Like, what without a... giving up too much. Like, yeah, no exactly. spoilers. I guess, okay. Like, why do you like them? All right. All right, well, like, comment, subscribe. If you didn't yep. do it already, do it now. Up. Check out the link below the, for Patreon if you want early access to lost episodes a week before they hit YouTube, as well as full-length movie reactions. All right? Gotta love it. Until next time, have a good one. See ya. I'm like enamored and terrified of Locke all at the same time, <laughs> right? Yeah. He's my favorite and my least favorite character. I love everything that he says, and I hate everything that he says. It's very interesting. Welcome to Lost. <laughs>
man. Walk away now. You won't get your ass kicked. Should have stayed down, Jack. Jack! Come around that look! I woke up and it's just... I don't swim! Okay. There's deep breaths now. There was a woman. I was trying to... Did you get no, he's got you, you dipstick. Oh, we gotta go back. Can no one else on that island swim? <laughs> Kick your legs. I mean, why am I preaching to these people? I can't swim. Oh, now she goes. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I'm annoying myself already. Or is there? I don't, is she a mirage? No, everybody was seeing her. Boone was a former lifeguard too. Yeah, well, that uh, island kind of makes people See, crazy, they, right? I mean, they both saw her. They don't know who it was. Jack, maybe. Who was she? Her name was Joanna. How do they not have like a roster? We've been here six days and I never talked to her. I never said a word to her. Jack, yeah. don't. There are 47 of us and I never said a you single tried. word to her. Why don't didn't... they know everybody on that island? <laughs> Jack? Jack? Creepy ghost dad. Don't swallow it. Why not? Ocean water will make you thirsty. Why? Just don't swallow it, man. All right? Just tell them there's salt in it. Yeah, I know, because it's salty. <laughs> Your money's no good here. Then what the hell do you want? If you really think Five I... Five grand. <laughs> Shoot. Are you a Gemini? Yeah, I yeah. am. I thought so. You know, everyone thinks astrology is just a load of crap, but that's just because they don't get it. She's got pretty eyes. Who? The blonde. People find out this is all we have left, they're gonna freak out, man. The boar's running low until we can catch another one. What should we tell them? I don't know. Maybe we can make one of those water finding sticks. What should we do with the stuff we got? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Great to have a water finding stick. Have to dig to get the water, though. Water. You tell the others we're running low. That way we could ration it. Then you can decide. I'm what... not deciding anything. Why not? <laughs> Does he still not realize he's the leader of this pack? <laughs> Don't choose, Jack. Don't decide. Because when you fail, you just don't have what it takes. Well, that's rude. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> not now, man. I could have made it back. I think you're all noble and heroic for coming after me. I was fine. You're not the only one who knows what to do around here. You know that? I run a business. Hey, I'm talking to you. Look at me, Jack. Can you find it odd that he's wearing white tennis shoes with his suit? It's just a weird thing to be wearing with your suit, even if you are a ghost. Right? You'd think a ghost would, like, if they're going to wear a suit, they'd finish it out. Creepy. Hmm. What's going on? Hallucinations. He doesn't have friends anymore. Why do you think that is? It's probably an alcoholic. You don't get to say I can't. Not after what you did. Ooh, what'd he do? Where is he? Somewhere on a deserted Australia. island. <laughs> oh, he's in Australia. His mom sent him on that suicide mission. Scatter. That pregnant lady fell down. What happened? She just dropped. It must be the heat. Is she breathing? I think. Come on, let's get her inside. She's probably anemic. Claire? Maybe going through preeclampsia. 
still. It's okay. It's okay. Which stole it? Keeping it all in one place. Foolish. When the others find out the water's gone, it's gonna get ugly. I'll go. Camp needs you two here, especially with the doctor gone. And beside, I know where to look. Because he hasn't used his legs in years and he can walk like no problem. <laughs> <laughs> and he wants to. I'm sorry, sir. I shouldn't. Come on, what's that have to do with renting a Mr. car? Mr. Shepard, I don't think any rental agent in Sydney would lease your father a car in his condition. My father is the chief of surgery. Of course, sir. I apologize. Your father is wasted out of his mind. Well, he's definitely dead. Probably. I don't know. Maybe he's not. Great. His father's secretly trying to kill him. His father's ghost is trying to kill him. You okay? Yeah. Okay. I mean, you tell me, who would you rather meet in a dark alley? Whatever's out there or that geezer with his 400 knives. <laughs> when are they going to rescue us? Soon. Thanks, Charlie. They'll be here soon. <laughs> he says six seasons later. Where did you she get... She doesn't understand She understands you, me. Who gave you this? I don't see the water. Well, it's about time. For what? I made this birthday wish four years ago. Where's the water? <laughs> I traded Mr. Miyagi the last of my water for a fish he caught. We worked it out caveman style. You gave him your last two bottles. Water has no value, freckles. It's gonna rain sooner or later. And hell, I'm an optimist. Better hope it rains in the next three days. Or you're out of luck. Hey, you forgot something. Seeing as you're the new sheriff in town, might as well make it official. You know, that's a good way to calculate things. What? You do three minutes without air, three days with no water, three weeks with no food. Yeah. Rule threes. Yep. I think I'm going crazy. Well, you're not going crazy. No. No, crazy people don't know they're going crazy. They think they're getting sad. <laughs> so, why are you out here? I'm like enamored and terrified of Locke all at the same time. <laughs> right? Yeah. But this place is different. The others don't want to talk about it because it scares them. But we all know it. We all feel it. He's my favorite and my least favorite character all at the same time. <laughs> Is your white rabbit a hallucination? Probably. But what if everything that happened here happened for a reason? What if this person that you're chasing is really here? But I've looked into the eye of this island and what I saw was beautiful. I love everything that he says and I hate everything that he says. It's very interesting. <laughs> Welcome to Lost. <laughs> Told you he was dead. Still don't know why he's wearing tennis shoes, though. Don't jump off another cliff again. Gosh, that's creepy. Box full of creepy dolls. <laughs> Is 
Is it the tail end of the plane? Oh, it's his dad. Oh, no latitude. No latitude. No latitude. Without the proper documents. Look, you can't do this to me. I'm ready to go now. Perhaps another carrier. No! In 16 hours, I need to land at LAX. And I need that coffin to clear customs because there's going to be a hearse waiting there. I need to bury my father. You don't need to open it. He's probably in there. Oh. Those things lock. They lock pretty tight after they put someone in them. So it's weird that the body would just disappear. man for himself is not going to work. But we're all here now. And God knows how long we're going to be here. But if we can't live together, we're going to die alone. You need some water? Thanks, honey. Oh, okay. Got it. Just make sure you're alright. Huh. A little bit about Jack. What do you think? I got more questions than anything, I think. I really am wondering why his dad was wearing white tennis shoes with a suit. Huh? <laughs> Where the hell the body went. Unless by some chance they removed the body before it was put on the plane. But why would they do that? Well, they were kind of telling Jack that they couldn't take it. Maybe they. Yeah, but you wouldn't just remove the him. body from a casket and then put the casket on, yeah. right? I don't know. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe we'll find out. Maybe we won't. I don't know if it's relevant. <laughs> <laughs> just need to know for my brain. I guess we'll see who's next in yep. this next episode. All who right. we're going to learn more about. Should we jump right in? Let's do it. All right. Let's watch the next episode. That's me. Hardcore. You guys are finished verbally copulating. We should get a move on. There's a whole beach of people waiting for us to get some drink. And the great white hunter's getting restless. Okay, let's do this. Hey, hey, put the ball! Oh, jeez. What the hell? All these people just standing around watching him drown him? Why would she have told him? What happened? Why would you tell on him? Accidentally walking in on you? While you're naked in the middle of the forest where there's no walls or anything? Like, I wouldn't tell you somebody saw me naked. If it was accidental. I mean, he could tell me I wouldn't give a shit and be like, it was accidental. Whoop de do. Hope you enjoyed it. I would have. <laughs> Keep an eye out for any medical supplies. Drugs in particular. Drugs. Right. Great. He's standing on a beehive. <laughs> What's the beehive doing there? If he moves, you'll split the hive. I don't like bees, okay? I have an irrational fear of bees. I think I'm allergic Please to bees. Please be quiet. Cuff, stay on. A little louder, Omar. Maybe then she'll understand you. Guys, that Chinese dude's gonna get pretty crispy out here. <laughs> How am I gonna keep him tied down like that? 
He tried to kill Michael. We all saw it. The cuffs stay on until we know why. 자기야, 이렇게 비싼 걸 어떻게 샀어? 이제 이 정도는 할수 있어. Yeah, after a year of man management training, a year working in the factory, you should be able to afford it. <laughs> <laughs> Loving, doting boyfriend becomes crazy, jealous husband. First, I was thinking it was like a cultural thing, but that doesn't really seem to be cultural. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jump in the water. It's a really old body. Like 16 years old, maybe? Any idea how long they've been here? Long. It takes 40 or 50 years for clothing to degrade like this. What is it? Glad my diversion spared you. I was only stung several hundred times. <laughs> Someone left this. It was, um, it was full of bees. I'd have thought of seas, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Great joke. <laughs> it's full of seas, actually. <laughs> Who were these men? Actually, one of them's female. Our very own Adam and Eve. He's a puppy. He's a wrinkly puppy. What's that? A little chow. Or a sharpe or something. We don't need to bring the water to the people. We need to bring the people to the water. I think we could live here. She was afraid you were going to say that. <laughs> so now it means you got to stay there. Oh, it's a sharp pay. How long since you played? My guitar, uh, eight days, 11 hours. You will see it again. Oh, yeah? What makes you say that? Because I have faith, Charlie. Again, I love what he says, and I'm creeped out by it all <laughs> at the same time. Our best hope of survival is in being spotted by a plane or a ship. And for that, we need to organize everyone to keep that signal fire burning while others scout the island for supplies. Turns out you have a huge f plane on the beach, though. You don't think that will <laughs> flare a red flag there? I'm not going to admit defeat. The signal flame is only helpful in the middle of the night when it's dark. <laughs> they can't see the beach. So what's it like having both the doctor and Captain Falafel fighting over you? <laughs> Call them how I see them, Freckles. <laughs> Truth be told, I'm not the only one wondering where you're going to weigh in on this whole moving off the beach thing. We all pack up stakes for the caves. Next day a plane passes by. They're going to go on their merry way and be none the wiser. On the other hand, stay here. Huge plane on the beach. Nobody's going to miss that if they're looking for them. And if the plane's high enough that they can't see him, they're not going to see him doing anything else. <laughs> oh, 
당신이 원하는 대로 자유롭게 움직일 수가 있죠. Mm. Yeah, that's about. She's trying to run away. I need to talk to you. <laughs> Speak English? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> This whole <laughs> time? You speak English? My husband doesn't know. Why would you learn English and not tell your husband? Honor. You call trying to kill me in front of my kid, Honor. You don't know my father. I need your help. Hey, Karumba. <laughs> Do you want your guitar more than your drug? More than you know. What I know is that this island just might give you what you're looking for, but you have to give the island something. What did Locke give the island to get that boar and to come face to face with that giant monster and nothing happened? Also, we haven't seen the monster in two episodes now. You really think you can find my guitar? Look up, Charlie. You're not going to ask me to pray or something. It's in the tree. You look up. <laughs> Dumbass, it was there the whole time. <laughs> Could have had his drugs and his guitar. <laughs> Just what is it that you did? You had your chance to know. If you need me, you knew where to find me. So we all have to wonder because Jack didn't ask when he could have. <laughs> It's rude. I found this in the wreckage. And I figured, hey, why let a $20,000 watch go to waste? Which is ridiculous, since time doesn't matter on a damn island! Well, now you can't use the handcuffs. That was dumb. All right. All right. Two more episodes down. We learned a little bit about the Korean couple here. Yeah. So what do you think? I am on board with Jack's attempt to move the group to the waterfall because mm -hmm. it makes logical sense from a survival standpoint. Yep. But I understand the ones wanting to stay behind on the beach because yep. they haven't given up hope yet, even though they probably should because there's nobody coming. <laughs> <laughs> But That's for them to find out, I guess. Yeah. I'm sure, like, as day, every day passes, more and more be like, oh. Yeah. I might as well move the water now. Nobody's coming, right? They're only a week in at this point. Yeah. yeah. I also really dislike the beach yeah. and the heat. Sand gets everywhere. Yeah. yeah. You said earlier, though, the, the monster hasn't made an appearance. Yeah, and on two episodes now. How safe is the, the cave, the waterfall cave? To the monster you think well it's hard to say but it looks like there were people living there for quite a while yeah. so maybe it it's yeah. secluded enough jack did say the entrance was narrow enough to yeah so this gigantic monster can't be seen yeah. can't get there or something i don't yeah. know we'll find out yeah i guess we i'm i am sure we will yeah why do you think kate stayed on the beach i'm not sure Yeah. She's a hard read for me, but I think she's a hard read intentionally. Yeah. Jack and her seem to be sparking something, and then it seems like she wants to get off the island, even though... Yeah, even though she's very well equipped to be on the island. Yeah. I don't know. And like, if she were to... the rescue boats come, she's probably going to be arrested, right? Yeah, she's got kind of every reason to want to stay on the island, and yeah. yet she's the one that isn't wanting to leave the mm -hmm. beach. I don't know. She's a weird read. I can't read her yet. So we have Jack episode. We have the Korean couples episode. Um, where do you think, who do you want to see next time? Well, I have a feeling we're going to see Claire's backstory at some point in time, at some point in time very soon, because she's going to be having a baby relatively soon. Right. So we'll need to know her backstory 
I guess it'll probably be in the episode that she has her baby. So maybe we've got some time still. I don't know. Yeah. Um, I'd really like to know what Hurley's story is. Yeah. Yeah. He's he's still yeah. my favorite. So you made the they they came from Australia. They're going from Sydney to LAX. So what were all these people doing in Australia? Is kind of what we're yeah trying to get at. Yeah, I don't still don't know how the Korean couple ended up in Sydney. I think they were there for work for her her husband's. But that son's husband da- was working for her her dad. But that person scheduled her getaway car from Australia. They were trying to make her disappear. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah, she, she was trying to, to make herself disappear. Yeah, I mean that's flat. very much like a a battered woman's story, just mm-hmm. back and forth in general. You know, wanting to leave but not knowing how. Yeah. Anybody else you want to see a backstory? Who who do you think is going to be the next episode about? Sawyer's got to be in there soon, right? Yeah. I'm guessing Sawyer, and I would imagine more Charlie since he's going to be going through withdrawal soon. Yeah. All right. All right. Would you have stayed on the beach? Let us know in the comments. Or would you have gone to yeah. the caves with Jack? Are you a beach person or a cave person? Yeah. Let us know in the comments below. Would you stay with Saeed and his group? Or would you have gone with Jack to the, the water? Practical or hopeful? Yeah. Let Just us like know. the two practical or hopeful. And as always, let us know your favorite character of Lost in the comments down below. Always like to know. Don't give us spoilers for the character, but let us know why you like him without jumping into spoilers, right? Yeah, or why you like them from these first six episodes. Yeah. yeah. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already done that. And come back next time. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to all our episodes of Lost a week before they hit YouTube, as well as all of our other releases. And uh, full-length commentaries on there as well, and a whole bunch of other stuff. So check it out. The link's down below. Until next time, have a good one, folks. Bye. Don't kiss him. Stab him. Don't kiss him. Don't kiss him. I'd be happy to see him die right now. Where's the f***ing monster when you need it? Howdy, folks! Welcome on back to you, me, and the TV. Tonight, we're continuing our trek on the island as we watch some more Lost. Where were we last time? Remember? I found a cave. Found a cave. Water. Yeah. Jack tried to move a group there, or part of the group went there, part of the group stayed on the beach. Yep. I kind of see it as, like, the hopeful still hanging out on the beach, and the pragmatists, uh, you know, just yep. trying to survive, mm-hmm. where it's more likely that they're going to survive, probably. Yeah. So what do you think is going to happen? I don't know. I'm I'm assuming there's going to be a resurgence of this invisible monster, because yep. we didn't see it for two episodes, you guys. Two episodes. It's coming back this one. It's mm-hmm. got to. Got to. And I'm guessing it's going to eat somebody. All right. Just it's going to eat somebody? It, it must. must be hungry, right? Yeah. I mean, there's lots of extra characters there that we haven't met, so I'm guessing it'll eat one of those. Was there 47 or 46 left? I can't 46, remember. What was the count after that lady drowned? I think. It was 46. Yeah. Because the U.S. Marshal died and it made 47, and then that lady died. The random lady that nobody, nobody knew. <laughs> the unnamed character. Right. So they're down to 46 survivors. Oh, she had a name, but I don't remember what it was. I forgot it already, too. Yeah. So. All right, well, should we jump right in? Might as well. All right. But first, like, comment, subscribe, thumbs up. Hit that like button. And check out our Patreon link down below. Links down below if you want early access, full-length commentaries, and a whole bunch of other stuff. Check out the link below. Let's watch some Lost. Let's go. Oh, yeah, Charlie found his guitar. Oh, but he's gonna be a little worse for wear for a while. Come on. Fresh air will do you good. I mean, he's outside already. <laughs> How much more fresh air can he get? It's probably musty in the cave. That could be, right. I wish I shared your faith. I was my sharing a few things with her myself. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want, Sawyer? Heard the doc here is vacating the premises. Oh, best lay claims to my new digs before somebody else did. I can fix this place up real good. 
I didn't find somebody to share it with me. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> He's like, see ya! <laughs> Is that you? Lock squeal like a pig. Bless Dinner. Me, Father, for I have sinned. Relations with another girl. Then straight after that, I I watched while they had relations with each other. Well, we all have our temptations, but giving in to them, that's your choice. Well, then I've made my choice. I have to quit the band. I'm glad I could oblige. Now give me my bloody drugs. Oh, no. Really just dump the drugs out, then yeah. he can't have them. Then there's no giving him dr drugs back. Throw him off the cliff. I'll let you ask me for your drugs three times. The third time, I'm gonna give them to you. Now, just so we're clear, this is one. Just get rid of him and have done with it. If I did that, you wouldn't have a choice, Charlie. And having choices, making decisions based on more than instinct, is the only thing that separates you from him. Interesting. Locke is crazy. All about these, like, deep philosophical, moral things. Something from the laptop computer would probably work, but I've not been able to find anything. I think I might know where to look. Sawyer. You've been hoarding like a pack rat since the crash, and you don't have a single laptop. We are testy. Still upset about your little breakup? Sorry. Just trying to help. Oh, I know. It's okay. Hey, want to help me grab the rest of those bags? No, he's trying to find drugs. Won't happen, because I'll be there looking out for you. We look out for each other. What brothers do, right? I say we're done. We walk away. You heard of Jab Shaft? No. What's your cookie, Moya? No, Moya, I'm not. Can you grow it, Bob? No, fuck off. She's fine. That's all right. Just calm I'm down, all right? You're not yourself, right? You now. don't know me. I'm a bloody rock god. Oh, no. Are they gonna have to move back to the beach now? <laughs> Where's Jack? Yeah, downside to being in a cave. Cave ends. Mm -hmm. Switch is where now? Did you hear what I said? Can you or can't you do it? Yeah, I can. Okay. Okay. Hey, we have to tell Kate about Jack! Sorry, sport. Just missed her. Her and Muhammad headed in the woods about ten minutes ago. Which way? Don't swear to me, y'all. He's such a dick. Way way. Yeah, but I'll tell her. You just keep doing whatever it is you do around here. You all everybody. Don't do that. Turned his mic off. Yeah, show you were bloody brilliant. I sing the chorus to you all, everybody. Oh, yeah, sorry. About that. Mm. It's like, I got caught up in the moment, like the crowd wanted it, you know. Yeah, I know, but yeah. if I start and then you come in after. Oh, she's cool, let her in. Won't happen again, I promise. Hey. What the hell are you doing here? Easy. I just came to tell you something. What makes you think I'm interested in anything you have to say? I just came to tell you you were right about me. That I don't help anyone but myself. Well, here I am, ready to pitch in. You're here to help. This moth's just about to emerge. It's in there right now, struggling. It's. I could help it. Take my knife, gently widen the opening, and the moth would be free. But it would be too weak to survive. The struggle is nature's way of strengthening it. Now, this is the second time you've asked me for your drugs back. Ask me again, and it's yours. He's like f***ing Yoda, <laughs> right? He is like Yoda. He's now my favorite character. <laughs> I love everything that he says. I still don't know why he says it all, but he is the greatest. 
I don't trust them with you. I can handle them. Yeah, yeah, she's murdered, probably. <laughs> we don't know. I don't know, maybe you guys do. Okay, get out. One of us is gonna have to go in and unpin him. What, crawl through that? I think you mean someone smaller. No life. <laughs> I'm alone here. No one on the island. Let me do this. Charlie's stepping up. Hell, give me a couple of band-aids, bottle of peroxide. I could run this island too. <laughs> You're actually comparing yourself to Jack. Word from the valley is Saint Jack got himself buried in a cave. -in. What? Look at the bright side. Now you have someone else to pity. Oh, jeez. He was going to tell her if she didn't give him attitude when he first showed up. Yeah. Breathe. This is like the descent all over again. <laughs> you love caves, don't you? <laughs> okay. Liam, pass off! Freaking musicians. So sensitive. <laughs> Super. <laughs> A good thing he was already dirty. I'm, uh, I'm at the rescue. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, great. Kate. Where is he? Where's Jack? He's in there. Is he alive? We don't know. He was Charlie before the you. second cave in. <laughs> Come on. She manhandled that huge ass rock pretty easily. <laughs> My shoulder's dislocated. What? You're gonna have to pop it back in. No, I can't. I need your help on this, man. I can't do it, Jack. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. No! Oh! Thanks for your help, brother. Stay, please. I was just looking out for you. You never looked out for me. I have a plane to catch. You're not useless. That took a lot of guts getting in here and trying to rescue me. Won't forget that. For the rest of our lives. The rate we're using our oxygen in here. That won't be too long. Hey, you want to hear my confession? <laughs> Might take a while. <laughs> hey, I'm no saint either. Or what? Right behind you, look, look there's, a, there's a bloody moth in here. Look, there's light. What? I can see light. It's poetic, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking poetic. A little moth coming out of his. Goddamn cocoon! <laughs> hey, it's the doctor! Oh, ow! Easy. Are you sure? Well, Charlie found a way out. Dude, you rock! <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, everyone. Now it's your turn. Out of the air, but the guys there are such idiots. <laughs> Come on, Sawyer. Where are you? Where are you? <laughs> WTF? <laughs> Couldn't have been Sawyer. He lit the rocket. Give them to me. This is the third time. Are you sure you really want to? I've made my choice. Bummer. Maybe I'll throw it in the fire. Come on, Charlie. That a boy. That a boy. I'm proud of you, Charlie. Always knew you could do it.
It was a good episode. I so except- are you getting more and more uh, drawn into this show? Well, yeah, at Locke at this point is single handedly piquing my interest. Yeah. You're like, you just want to know more about I him. I need to know what his deal is because he's <laughs> he's like Yoda, right? He says all of these profound things. It's pretty impressive. He's yeah. like the driving force for for the show so far. Yeah, I mean, well, a lot of people, and I, I've been asking in our you know like, titles and stuff. When do you think you're going to get hooked? Mm-hmm. A lot of people said episode four, which was Locke's episode, his first yeah. episode. Walkabout, and I think his character is really they were right, yeah. It's, it's drawn you into the show, yep. And I think as you learn more about the other characters, I think you're gonna, yeah. No, I think I'm even more. Hooked, so. I'm, I'm, I hate to say I'm hooked, yeah, <laughs> but I'm definitely intrigued mm-hmm. and willing more than willing to watch more episodes exactly. of this to figure out what's going on. Well, we got a new mystery now, though. The, who hit who Saeed? Hit, yeah, who hit Saeed? I don't know. So you got a mystery to solve, Miss Detective. Yeah, don't know how that's gonna work. Think about that for a little bit. We don't bit. even really know any other characters. Well, it's likely it's got to be somebody that we've met. It's not gonna be, you know, Steve or Sean. <laughs> yeah, I know, but who else wasn't either at the cave or yeah. at the beach that we've met? Yeah. I don't know. The mystery, huh? Unless it's the French woman. <laughs> you can't find my signal. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, should we jump in the next episode? Let's do it. Let's watch the next episode of Lost. I got Sawyer's reading Watership Down. Hell of a book. Is he naked? <laughs> it's about bunnies. <laughs> Cold without your trunks. You bet. How about you come a little closer, warm me up? You sure know how to make a girl feel special, Sawyer. Incredible, Sawyer. Hi, <sighs> <sighs> I'll use you as a dish. <laughs> Exactly supposed to see that. <laughs> what are you doing in my stuff, son? This is gonna hurt. Whoever hit me came from behind. They destroyed the equipment? Yes. Listen, we're gonna figure this out, but don't do anything. I will do what I need to do to find the man responsible. What happened? Sawyer. Hmm. What? He said I'll do... I'll, he's got to find the man responsible, right? So it must be a woman. A woman <laughs> that, that hit him on the head? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It was her. Claire. Yeah, I doubt that. <laughs> In your condition, with the extra baggage, you know. Well, I can still walk. She Damn. walked up the hill and smacked Saeed in the back of the head. <laughs> There's plenty of hats in the caves. And we got a doctor there as well. That'll come in handy. I like the beach, Charlie. Yeah. I want to be here for when we get rescued. Oh, Jack, it's fine. It's just a scrape. Yeah, lots of scrapes today. <sighs> you can run out of hydrogen peroxide. <laughs> I'm impressed they had any peroxide. Who carries peroxide it's on a plane? First aid kits on the plane with it. Today I see that jackass reading Watership Down. Wait, you're, you're losing me. It was in my bags, the stuff that I checked. If he has my book, he has my luggage. If he has the luggage, he has the inhalers. You sure you want to make this your problem, Doc? Oh, yeah. I'm sure. Hey! What's going on here? What makes you think he's going to listen to you? He says we have a connection. (laughs) Do you? Please. (laughs) (laughs) One of these days, I'm going to find you, and I'm going to give you this letter so you'll remember what you've done to me. You killed my parents, Mr. Sawyer. Technically, his dad killed his son. parent, but I mean, like, about that kiss? I didn't think so.
I think. Got a distress call? So it would seem whoever attacked you has a reason for not wanting to get off the island. He would. Maybe someone who is profiting from our current circumstances. It's his miracle island. But when would he have had time? How could he possibly have been? Anyone who watches television knows how to improvise a slow fuse. So it was him. But how? Just in case there's a next time. He's got plenty, so. Of knives. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't think you had it in you. That all you got. David? Wait. He's a crook. I can get you peanut butter. Yeah, sure you can. Yes, I can. And when I get you peanut butter, you have to vacate this sandy shore of depression and move to the caves. Deal? Deal. Uh, Help! She's not breathing! Uh, the attacks are getting worse. Keep her relaxed. Do not let her panic. Yeah. That was like a... Jedi moment. <laughs> Just give me ten minutes with him. He'll give us the medicine. Oh, that's confidence. <laughs> <laughs> All I need is ten minutes. Yes. Let's say you're gonna do to him. I don't know. <laughs> Torture him for ten minutes? <laughs> No peanut butter, no peanuts, no nothing. Yeah, but there's got to be something. I mean, look at you. And for the record, I'm down a notch in my belt. Oh. I'm a big guy. It's going to be a while before you're going to want to give me a piggyback ride, OK? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. That was bad form. Yeah. <laughs> it was bad form. Good morning. It's like waterboarding. It doesn't have to be this way. What are they gonna do? <laughs> yeah, it does. He's like trying to get somebody to kill him or something because he feels so guilty. Why is he such a dick? When the shoots are inserted underneath the fingernails. Eek. <laughs> That's it. That's all you got. Splatters. Leaky. Ah! <laughs> Only person I'll tell is our Kate. That's the deal. He's such a dick. I don't like this storyline. I don't like Sawyer. I think he's an ass. I know that's the point, but... Happy to tell you. As soon as I get that kiss. What? What a f***ing pig. Are you serious? Just not seeing the big picture here, Freckles. You really gonna let that girl suffocate? I would kick him in the f***ing face. <laughs> kiss him with your f***ing shoe. Okay. Just punch him right in the f***ing face. Don't kiss him. Stab him. Don't kiss him. Don't kiss him. Oh, Jesus. I'd be happy to see him die right now. <laughs> Where's the fucking monster when you need it? Really? He doesn't have, have it. it. Yeah, what a fucking pig. What? Book washed up on shore. Went a drink with the rest of the... I hate this guy so much. He doesn't have it. What? He's lying. Can't you see that? He destroyed the transceiver! You don't know that! <laughs> he hit an artery. I hope he bleeds out. I don't feel for, bad for him a bit. I hope he dies. Such an ass. Let go. I know you want to. Shut up. 
and stop moving. You've been waiting for this, haven't you? Now you get to be a hero again. Because that's what you do. Fix everything up all nice. Because I've been trying to figure out why you beat up Boone instead of just telling him you didn't have his sister's medication. Because he wants somebody to kill him because he feels guilty about it. Obviously. The thing that I keep coming back around to is that you want to be hated. This letter wasn't written to you. You wrote this letter. This guy is mental. Your name's not Sawyer, is it? I was out for a tragedy. Came the man I was hunting. Came Sawyer. Don't you feel sorry for me? Get the hell out. I have I have a few hand gestures for this guy <laughs> that I just, I just could give two about his story. No way. Just like you ordered. Oh, there is one thing. It's extra smooth. That's okay. It's empty. What? No. No, it's not. It's full. Full to the brim. With... Stick to the roof of your mouth. the best bloody peanut butter I've ever tasted. <laughs> He's hooking her. She's sweet. You want some? <laughs> <laughs> what I did today, I swore to do never again. I have no right to be here. There's nowhere to go. Someone has to walk the shore and map the island. I can't think of a better person to do it than the only one I trust. I like Saeed's character. So they keep the jackass. Get rid of the one guy who is actually nice. I mean, yeah, he tried to torture him, but <laughs> for a good reason. You're breaking my heart, though, because Sawyer's my favorite character. What? Ah. How? Just gotta keep watching. No, he's a prick. I see almost no redeeming qualities in Sawyer. His heartbreaking story was not heartbreaking to me. It was just annoying. As a human being, I feel like we have choices. We mm. have the right to make choices. He has chosen to be a complete ass from the beginning. Yeah. What, because he has trauma in his life? It's not an excuse. You have the choice to be a good person or a bad person. Nice or a dick. And he's choosing to be a dick. And I don't appreciate that. I don't like it. I don't know how you appreciate his character at all. I've seen the whole, sh the whole show. All right? So I'm just telling you at the end of the world. It's going to take a I lot like to get me back on board to be a I mean, you're fan of Sawyer. You're kind of where Kate is now. Kate's like, why Why do you want everybody to hate you? Right? No, he, Kate. She asked him that this, this episode. Kate likes him. Well, I mean, Kate, I think, sees a shiny object kind of thing. I don't like Sawyer at all. Yeah. That's all right. You don't have to like everybody on the show. Again, these two episodes were missing the giant invisible monster. Never reared its head again. Don't understand that. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it'll show up sooner and later. And we're about, it's... what, we're eight episodes in, so we're about a third of the way through this, this first season. Now they're sending Saeed away. Yeah. He's the only one actually trying to help them get off the f***ing island. Yeah. Do you, who do you think uh, actually hit him? Do you have any clues? Or... Locke makes the most sense to me, yeah. just because he has the... The motive? The, yeah, the most to gain by staying. Yeah. Because it's his miracle island. But I just don't know how he would get to that part of that island so quickly. And I don't know. He's kind of unaccounted for. Yeah. I don't know. Locke makes the most sense. But I still think Locke is like Yoda. So I don't want to believe that he would intentionally like sabotage. Yeah. Even though he has the most to gain from sabotaging. Yeah. We're a third of the way through the season. What, what's gonna? What do you think develops next? No idea. Yeah. This this shows all over the board. Yeah, introduces a new mystery, 
yeah. every episode with a little bit of question answered here and there. Right. You learn a little bit about each character each mm-hmm. episode. You may not like all of them. Based Sawyer, on their backstory. He makes my blood and their boil. Attitude. He right. makes my blood boil. If you haven't noticed, I'm a little feisty right now. <laughs> <laughs> and it's because of him. Yeah. Who would you like to see next that you haven't seen a backstory for? I mean, who's the only one? Like Hurley and the pregnant girl. Yeah. They're pretty much, well, I guess Ian Summerhalder yeah. and Boone his and sister. sister yeah. I don't really care what their backstory is, you I don't think. not seen Saeed's yet either, too. That's true. I feel like I the way that he's been such a prominent character, though, you feel like you maybe know what his backstory is a little yeah. bit. But yeah, I guess I'd like to see Saeed's, but he's leaving, so we're not going to get to see that unless oh, okay. they go like on a Saeed adventure, just him. <laughs> Saeed adventure? <Yeah. laughs> Is that a play on words? A side adventure? A Saeed adventure? Sure, yeah, that's what you want it to be. <laughs> All right. All right, what should people comment on? Should people comment on, do you like Sawyer, or do you love to hate him, or do you hate to hate him? Right? Yeah, I meant Let us know in the comments him, what you situation. think of Sawyer. He's my favorite character, but I've seen all six seasons. I've watched the show before. So let us know what you think of Sawyer in the comments. No spoilers, of course, but if you like him, let us know. If you dislike him, let us know. We'll see. Uh, I got a big thumbs down yeah, we'll for see Sawyer. If it's a thumbs up or a thumbs down, she'll look at the comments, see how many people actually like him. I apologize right. for my feistiness, but he really rubbed me the wrong way this episode. <laughs> you all, everybody. <laughs> you all, everybody. In the comments, you all, everybody, you know what I mean, all right? Great. All right. Well. Yeah, like, comment, subscribe. If you feel up. like it after I've been yeah. such a crabby pants this last thirty minutes, but. <laughs> <laughs> and check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to all our lost episodes, as well as all the other videos we post on YouTube a week before they hit YouTube, as well as full length commentaries, and more. So check out the link down below. Until next time, have a good one, folks. I mean, doesn't it seem like they're in some sort of purgatory, right? Like, not in heaven with their family, not in the real world with other people, just trapped, thinking they're alive in this weird place. Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the TV. And today, we're heading on back to the island for oh, some lost. You remember where we left off last time? Some annoying episode about Sawyer, I think. <laughs> yeah, you learned about your favorite character, mm-hmm. Sawyer, mm-hmm. and how he's a con man. Yep. And uh, do you remember, other than backstories, where we were on the island? Oh, what's his butt got hit in the head? Saeed? Yep, Saeed got hit in the head, and now he's like off on his own, doing his own thing, searching the island for something. They didn't figure out where that radio signal was coming from. There was a cave-in. Mm-hmm. Jack almost died, but he didn't. The girl almost had an as- had an asthma attack, but she survived. Yeah. All right. They're still split between the beach and the caves. If you're in the comments, where would you be right now? Beach or the caves, let us know. If you were smart, you'd be at the caves. Yep. More sustainable. So what are you expecting this time? No idea. No idea? Should Not a Jump time. right in? Yeah. All right, let's do it. First, like, comment, subscribe. Come watch Lost with us. It's pretty awesome. Yep. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our Lost episodes, as well as Dexter and all the movies we watch on YouTube a week before they hit YouTube, as well as full-length commentaries. Check it out. The link's down below. Let's watch some Lost. Let's do it. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, oh. What's it attached to? Oh, Saeed. He's found something interesting. Jackass. You wanted easy, quit moaning. I gotta change these bandages. I will try not taking my skin off with him. Should have let him die. 
Only reason you're here. I'm here because no one else wants anything to do with you. Cheetah. I wish we could get away from this storyline. <laughs> Change your own bandages. Well, that's because of what happened. Because of what he did. It was an accident. Yeah, well, accidents happen when you torture people, Jack. If Sawyer would have just f***ing said, I don't have the freaking albuterol, right? Like, this... I feel like Sawyer definitely had it coming. This guy's a dick. Starting off strong already, calling people dicks. <laughs> A booby trap. Oh, Schnikey. I knew it was a booby trap and he stepped into it anyways. It's like was double just... it was like a double boot booby trap. Yeah. There's someone else on this island. They've already found dead bodies of other people on the island, so. Yeah, but they're really old, old dead bodies. Maybe these are old traps. Hello? Hello. Lock. Stress. Okay. Just try to relax, it'll clear up. Right. Try to keep your mind off it. Okay. What is that? Is it like aloe? <laughs> Dude, I'm just saying, it'd be sweet if we could have, I don't know, something to do. Like a game night? <laughs> and that's my main concern, is keeping us alive. Things could be worse. Start building shelters, put them to work. Oh. <laughs> Who the hell's Alex? I don't know what you're talking about. Where is Alex? I don't know any Alex. <laughs> They're using electricity on the island to torture people? He doesn't know anything. He won't miss being a communications officer. I'm willing to make that sacrifice. Good. Hi. Yo, what's this? What are you guys doing out in the jungle at night? Best time to hunt. Ethan here has some experience. Spotted some tracks, look like they might be rabbit or some other rodent. Figured people are starting to get tired of eating boar meat. Mm, you got that right. I'll take a look at these. Mm, see if there's anything useful. Okay. Whoa, dude. So the new guys we're not on the beach. They're just randos that they found in the woods. The what? <clears throat> I think they're just side characters. Like Scott and Steve. Mm. A recording. A mayday. With a French woman repeating on a loop for 16 years. She's the French woman. Is she a ghost? 16 years. Has it really been that long? Oh boy. You. you just happen to hear my distress call? I know what you are. <laughs> Who the hell is Alex? And how did she get power? How do you know my name? <laughs> I read it. There on the jacket. What is this place? Torture bunker. Duh. Those batteries. They wouldn't be able to produce enough power to transmit your distress call all these years. It broadcasts from somewhere else. But they control it now. 
that Acme Corporation situation. You think she knows who orchestrated the bombing? Well, that, my friend, is exactly what you will find out. But there's nothing to do around. Well, you gotta figure out stuff to do, know what I'm saying? You gotta find a way to entertain yourself. Yeah, build some shit. Dude, can I borrow this? What? Thanks, man. Hey, Hurley, what are you doing? <laughs> She's dead. I'm so sorry. I want to show you something. What is happening here? <laughs> sorry. Hey, Jack! Hurley's all worked up about something. She said we should come see it. Capture the flag. <laughs> you built a golf course? Rich idiots fly to tropical islands all the time to whack balls around. All the stuff we gotta deal with, man. You've been wasting your time on? <laughs> Dudes, listen. Our lives suck. Freaking polar bears. Polar bears? You didn't hear about the polar bear? Look, all I'm saying is <laughs> we're not gonna cut it. We need some kind of relief, you know? We need some way that we can, you know, have fun. Because the big, giant, invisible monster just doesn't exist anymore? What is written on the back of your photograph? What are you doing? Did she write it? We don't need to do that. Why? Hey! Heads up over there! <laughs> uh, are you playing golf? Yeah. Can I play? <laughs> it gets you to stop talking about your rash. <laughs> it was the only safe way for me to move you. You offered to fix my music box. And how did you come to be on this island, Daniel? We were part of a science team. A science team armed with rifles? Our vessel was three days out of Tahiti. When our instruments malfunctioned. The message I heard, you said it killed them all. Did she kill them all? They were the carriers. Who were the carriers? The others. What others? Have you seen other people on this island? No. But I hear them. Out there in the jungle, they whisper. Now she's a lunatic. You think I'm insane? I think you've been alone for too long. Oh You're good, she's still this. sunbathing. You finally learned how to tie your own shoes. Apparently Jack's playing with him right now. Jack is golfing. That's what I hear. He's a doctor. What'd that do? Doctor playing golf. Oh, Jesus. Woo. Boy, howdy. I've heard everything. What's he the... makes my skin crawl. If you want to come, you should just say. I think I'll pass it's gonna be a, a long series of every time Sawyer talks, my skin crawls. <laughs> One outcast to another? I think about making more of an effort. Duly noted. It's safe. What's not safe? You need me. You can't leave. Thank you. <laughs> Where are you going? Is that an lucky? elephant? It's one of the bears. If we're lucky. Uh, there's no way she's been on that island for 16 years and still has ammunition in her gun. Like, no freaking way. Put it on. Are you going to hurt me, Saeed? Nah, he's gonna kill you. Won't hurt a bit. Oh, she's gonna be pissed. Everyone feels safe. Ah, crap. Do over. Hey, it's a mulligan. <laughs> mulligan. It's a gentleman's sport. You gotta get the words right. Mulligan. <laughs> hey, come here. Check this out. 
Come here, let me. Duke, get away from me. <laughs> Put it down on the ground. Don't. You stole my gun and you shot him. And then you shot me. Oops. The firing pin has been removed. Didn't think to check. No. Watch them. Watch them closely. Does it start as hives? The sickness? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, please. Never made power on a course before. <laughs> I got two tubes of sunscreen, a flashlight says he chokes. I'll take that action. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Did he make it? Don't know. Yeah. The French lady. We found her. She's alive 16 years later. I'm mostly interested in the logistics of how there's electricity, where it's running from, how she got it there, if she found it there, if she made the shack that she's in, if it was there before. <laughs> I, I'm just mostly interested in the logistics of it. Yeah. Less interested in her character so far, but... You think she's crazy? Oh, Definitely. From a, like, I've been alone on an island for 16 years. Crazy. Yeah. Well, she lets say you'd go, so. Yeah. I mean, she's not, like, that crazy. Yeah. Just, <laughs> just a little crazy. Just a little loony, right? Yeah, exactly. Right. Let's say you'd hearing things? No, I think the. She was actually telling the truth about the whispers. Yeah, whispers yeah. happen. All right. right. All right. Okay. Well, should we continue on? No. No? Yeah, obviously. Right. Let's watch the next episode of Lost. It would be weird if she had a baby and didn't know it, huh? It's gotta be a nightmare. It's creeping me out. I don't like it. It's the baby part. There's also something about a baby crying that makes me want to cry, right? Must be that mom in me. What's happening? You know what's happening. Why? It was your responsibility, but you gave him away, Claire. Everyone pays the price now. <laughs> I don't like this at all. I don't like it at all. Terrors. Claire, what happened? Oh, did she lose the baby? Must have been a hell of a nightmare. He said it was a nightmare. Oh, it was her hands that were bleeding. So Not someone makes a fist so tight they dig their fingernails a quarter of an inch into their palms. Ugh. Probably weren't dreaming about riding ponies. Cheers. Okay, it's definitely two lines. Two pink lines? Pink? No, no, no. These are like red. 
These two lines... Okay, first of all, these tests are not always accurate. Thomas! No, 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 my uncle, you know, we thought he had uh, testicular cancer, you remember that? He did, he's dead! <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, no, no, it was like a wrong... It was a bad diagnosis. Look, this thing, it doesn't mean for sure that it's you... It's also, like, Thomas. really touching the stick where she just peed. <laughs> I don't know. Could be like the best thing ever. You'd, you'd really want to try? Yeah. Claire. I love you. Water goes out, takes the sand with it, and the sink. I used to do it with my mom when I was a kid. Before you murdered your boyfriend? Or something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm driving a bus and my teeth start falling out. My mum is in the back eating biscuits because I don't wake up screaming. I'm all right, Charlie. If you needed someone to talk to, I'm here. She already promised to raise the baby with Hurley. <laughs> I didn't mean that I... It's cool, Claire. It's cool. Uh, you already are friends, though, right? <laughs> like... So when did you find out? What? About the baby? What? What is it? I'm sorry, um... I can't. What were you gonna? What did you say? I'm. I'm not doing this reading. No, you. you were he saw say you something. dying on an airplane, and your spirit being trapped on an island. Is that what you think the island is? I mean, bit. so much <laughs> happening on it. Like I can't imagine anything else at this point. Another night terror. Look, he stabbed me with it. He was trying to hurt my baby. It's okay. <sighs> She's losing it. So, I had an idea. I'm out here looking for some psycho with Scott and Steve, right? Oh, really, you're not helping me understand where Look, you're... we don't know who's living here and who's still at the beach. I mean, we didn't even know each other. My name isn't Hurley. It's Hugo Reyes. Hurley's just a nickname I have, all right? <laughs> Why? I'm not telling. The point is, we gotta find out who everyone is. You wanna start a census? Yeah, registry, you know, names, what people look like, who's related to who. And it seems like someone's getting punched or stabbed or something every other day here. We gotta I won't leave you, Glenn. I promise. I mean, doesn't it seem like they're in some sort of purgatory, right? Like, not in heaven with their family, not in the real world with other people, just trapped, thinking they're alive in this weird place. This isn't working. Oh, you knew that? I was? She just hung drapes, dude. It's like this now, you know? What's it gonna be like when the baby comes? Wow. Well, you can't just change your mind. How in the hell am I supposed to be a dad, Claire? You want a pussy. Excuse me? You were supposed to be on the pill. <gasps> you think I got pregnant on purpose? I don't or even that this care. was some kind of plan? You oh, man. Like, oh. Uh, you were supposed to be taking care of the birth control situation. <laughs> Fuck off! It takes two. You're two people responsible for babies. Mm -hmm. So did you find it? No, it found me. Anything else? No, no, that's good. Uh, thanks. Yeah. I mean, if he was dead, it would explain his miracle, right? Of course he can walk I mean, dead. Hey, your name's Lance, right? Ethan. Dude, that's right. <laughs> that's pathetic, huh? I think after a couple weeks on the island with the same people, we'd all know each other. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You would think so. so you don't believe me. No. Claire. You think I'm making this up? Not intentionally. Here. Don't do this, Claire. You need to think about the baby. Don't talk to me about the baby. Sick of everyone telling me what to do. Please. Let go of me. Psychics are really good about not telling you the horrible, horrible things that they see. <laughs> he should be able to fake it better than this. Danger surrounds this baby. Danger? Your nature, your spirit, 
your goodness must be an influence in the development of this child. She has a devil baby inside of her. <gasps> it's a little Dexter. <laughs> Miss Littleton, please. The baby needs your protection. Miss Littleton, please. That's a weird reading. <laughs> Look, I'm begging you. Don't do it. At least hear my plan first. Good night. The universe crashed them on this island because it's so afraid of the baby, of her giving up the baby to somebody else. It's like forcing her to raise her own baby, right? It's so creepy. Incident? Yeah, Claire, the pregnant girl, you know her? She uh, kind of got attacked. What? Shook up, I am but... so not moving to the rape caves. <laughs> you know your life would be much easier if you just had the manifest. So we cross out all the names of the dead after we burn the fuselage, so it should be a full roster of the rest of us. What? Really? Who has it? What do you think? Yeah, swear, Ted. I hear you had the flight manifest, and I need it. Want you to give it to me? That's so. Now you could do what you normally do when someone asks. For I can't something. even look at him without being just well, irate. Or you could just give it to me, cause, dude. You could use the points. Well, gosh, you sure know how to butter a man up, Stay Puff. It's a gift. Manifest in a brown suitcase. Take it. How are you going to watch the next season of Yellowstone if you can't even look at him? Probably not going to be able to. Oh, really? Charlie, I need you to go get Jack. What? I'll be all right. I'm not leaving you alone. Charlie, I, can, please, I can deliver a baby. Go. I can do this. This must happen. <laughs> I can deliver a baby. <laughs> I can't go tomorrow. I have to get my... It has to be this flight. It can't be any other. They're already scheduled to meet you when you arrive. Flight 815. There was no couple in Los Angeles. He knew about the plane. What was going to happen? Oh, my God, he knew. Let's go. Saeed! Listen to me. We're not alone. Jack, the census. The names of everyone who survived. All 46 of us. I interviewed everyone here at the beach. Got their names. Ethan's not one of them. One of them isn't in the manifest. He wasn't on the plane. Hello there. <laughs> Ethan's creepy now. <laughs> Where's Jack? Is that Alex? Her son's a lunatic? <laughs> hey, Karumba. All right. They're not alone. No, they are not. I think I know just enough about what could be on the island for it to be, like, confusing for me. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, I just don't know what the... What is the group called? It's not Acme. It's... What is the name of the... You'll find out. <sighs> Come on, you guys. No. You'll find out. Does he belong to them? Does he belong to Danielle? And he's, like, run away. And he's crazy because... He's been alone on the island for a while. All questions may be answered someday. Hey, Sawyer gave Hurley the manifest without complaints. Doesn't help me at all. Nope, nope. still no dislike points. him very much. No points gained? Not a single point for me. All right. So we learned more about Claire this episode, mm -hmm. and she had a psychic yeah. get her on the plane. Yep. You think he knew? Yep. He knew? That his first vision you saw, he <laughs> didn't want to talk about it? Exactly, yeah. So what do you, you were think you were talking about through that whole episode that you think they're all dead. Right. And they're a purgatory. Mm -hmm. Why would a psychic send Because the baby was an, like a, a, devil child. a spawn of Satan sort of baby, right? And like <laughs> okay. the only way to contain it is to kill it. Okay. Sort of situation. Wow. All right. Is that a horrible thing? <laughs> I'm assuming that they're all dead. Okay. And that this is just a big mind Yeah. Mm -hmm. What what just is a little confusing is if they're all like trapped in purgatory, why would they be together? Or like why would they 
No, I don't know. I mean, that's the, kind of the point of purgatory, though. Yeah. Questions need to be answered. You don't know that you're dead. Yeah. It's like right. a sixth sense sort of situation. In the first episode we watched tonight, Hurley built a golf course. Mm. What other games should they invent on the island to, you know, help relieve stress and pass the time while they wait to be rescued? Right? You know, I think we give people a lot of relief. Is like actually building shelter, yeah. building bed situations. I think they need tools for that, though. They don't really have... You can fashion a tool. Yeah. like Get locked to make some hammers and stuff or something. <laughs> I just feel like their best solution for anxiety is just preparing. Right. What easy games could they make, though, to relieve the stress other than work? Because work can... You still need recreation. Right? Bocce ball with coconuts. Bocce ball with coconuts. All right. Let us know your ideas in the comments below. Like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us, with us for the next Lost episode. All right, man. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our Lost episodes, as well as full-length commentaries and more. Links down below. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. You need this more than I do. What is that? So it's, it's a secret lair. But don't knock on it. What if somebody's home? Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the TV. Tonight, we're back on the island watching some love. Ooh. What happened last time we left the island? A new character, crazy lady, and a rando dude named Ethan. Mm -hmm. Don't know who he is. It ended it in like a who the f is this guy sort of situation. And he, he was, seems a little cuckoo. Was he the person Claire was getting attacked by in her no, dreams? No, I think Claire was just having some some like weird pre baby dreams okay well i mean ethan did jump out of the jungle at charlie and claire at the last scene though, yeah so. it's really weird i'm wondering what's gonna happen that's why i just would want to get into it all right so you should we you just want can we just can we just jump right in yeah all right let's watch some lost but first like comment subscribe my thumb yeah, looks yeah. just like the thumb that you push yeah, when push you it. like it Go like that yeah. isn't it like the exact same shape i mean yeah it's five fingers or a thumb and four fingers you overlay the thumb on my thumb, and you see almost exactly how pretty much it is. Yeah. And then check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to all our Lost episodes, as well as all the videos we post on YouTube a week before we post them on YouTube, as well as full-length movie commentaries and more. So check it out. The link's down below. Also, check out this amazing cookie. It's they're pretty, huge. They're pretty good. It's delicious. Best cookie recipe I've ever had. Right. I nailed this cookie. She nailed it. I made it myself. You're welcome. All right. Let's watch some Lost. She's moving back to the beach. Claire, that's hers. What happened? What? I don't know. Did he kidnap them? At least three distinct sets all over the place. It looks like there might have been a struggle. Hard to get away. Which way did they go, Locke? Come on back. Come on. Call it. You can do this. Come on. Come on. Call it, Jack. You know, yeah, give up after 25 seconds. F off. First rescue. She told me that your hands were shaking. My hands were not. You cut her a pad card. She was she, in a car. How many drinks did you have at lunch, Dad? Seven. If he had drinks at lunch, his hands should be nice and steady. They'd be shaky if he hadn't had a drink in a while and he was an alcoholic. Mr. Locke's a warrior. He can hunt, he can track stuff, and he's the only one who brought knives. So if it were me, I'd listen to him. 
Well, I don't want you to. Back home, I'm known as something of a warrior myself. What is his backstory? Look familiar? It's Charlie's. You think it just came off? No. Red crumbs. So we've got two trails. Let's split up. I'll take that one. No, we should stay together, Jack. Why? We've got two trails and apparently two trackers. Be careful. Took them while. And who the hell's Ethan? I don't know. He wasn't on the listing, the manifest. You ever think he might have lied about his name? It's stupid to lie about your name. <laughs> All righty, Tattoo. And why am I getting the evening news from a six-year-old? I'm 10. OK. Then it must be true. If you don't believe me, ask Saeed. He said we're not alone. Saeed's back. Uh-oh. Red shirt. You ever watch Star Trek? <sighs> not really. The crew guys? That would go down to the planet with the main guys? They always wore red shirts. And they always got killed. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. It sounds like a piss poor captain. I'm pretty sure Terry O'Quinn is in the Star Trek series. That guy? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I was a regional collection supervisor for a box company. A box company? World's most boring job you can imagine, probably. His brother works at Dunder Mifflin. <laughs> yeah. And you know it. But if you contradict this report, if you mention alcohol, well, that's the only fact that's going to matter. They'll strip me of my license. Yes. They will. Oh, this is what he did to his father. This is, this is not just about my career, Jack. So we either recanted it or it happened again. If it wasn't your intention to return, then why did you? I was taken prisoner by the French woman. She's alive. She was on a science expedition. But on my way back, I heard something in the jungle surrounding me. Something like what? <sighs> Whispering. <laughs> Kept your signal fire burning. No hard feelings. My role. Yahoo. I need a four or three. Do would you please roll? <laughs> yes. No. Your turn. I wasn't very good when I first started playing either. I didn't just start playing. I took 17th in a tournament once. 17's not very good. No, 17th. A backgammon tournament? You owe me $20,000! You'll get it. <laughs> He's good for it. <laughs> he swears. Temporarily. It's gonna start raining in one minute. One minute. Give or take a few seconds. He's like, I was right. They teach you how to predict the weather in a box company? I wonder if he's... Has he been recognizing the trends of the island or something? Like it's on a loop of some sort? You smell rain coming too, though. Yeah, that's true. We're two now. What's the f***ing pterodactyls coming? Jack, where are you going? Jack! Did you hear her? What? Here, here. scream. I heard it. If you do not stop following me, I will kill one of them. Do you understand? Uh. 
Come on, Kate. Get a big stick. No more warnings. Where the hell Jack. was Kate? Jack, you've got Jack! I'm not letting him do this. Not letting him? Not again. Why is he always gotta be running? You don't have to run. The blood pressure was was continuing to drop precipitously. At which point the patient went into cardiac arrest. You were aware of the patient's pregnancy when you went into the procedure. Absolutely. The it was, however, extremely early in the pregnancy. So our primary focus had to be on the mother. Okay, then. No. I think we're done here. I didn't come into the OR until well into the procedure. Jack. I was warned by one of the nurses that my father was operating under the influence. Jack, this is Which, in my professional opinion, caused the crisis which led to her death. Baby pushed him over the edge. Mm -hmm. Two laps, not one. Yeah. You gotta cut him down. What the f is Ethan gonna do with a pregnant lady about to give birth? Psycho crazy man. So, how did he manage to get him up that high? He's not breathing. Come on, breathe. Breathe, Charlie. Come on. Breathe. Come on. Come on, Charlie. Come on. Come on. Come on, Charlie. Come on! Jack! Come on! Jack! Stop! Come on. Jack! He's Come not! On. Jack, stop! He's not! Really? They kill off Charlie? is gonna hurt so bad <laughs> I've seen this before and it still got me Michael G's score so good I'm wondering how long it was oxygen per depri deprived what that's all they wanted they I, I don't know. all they wanted was clan I wonder if the psychic saw that crazy soul in the woods is anyone on this island that your brother's safe with Lock. We hope. We don't know a ton about Locke. <laughs> All right, John. I'm going to follow the strip back. Suit yourself. That's stupid. It's the middle of the night. Boom. You need this more than I do. Oh. What is that? It's a secret lair. I don't knock on it. What if somebody's home? Stop tapping on it. What is that? That's what we're going to find out. So what's going on? They found somebody's secret underground bunker or yeah, something. That's what they found. I think, yeah. but I don't know. Yeah. It makes me uncomfortable that they were tapping on it. Because what <laughs> if that crazy Ethan's in there? Uh -oh. So what do you think uh, Charlie was talking about? They only they only wanted Claire. Yeah, they're trying to like use her baby, right? That's why I wonder if the psychic the saw that happen, involved. right? Yeah. He's like, oh, these people 
are gonna steal her baby and do experiments on it. You think it's a little think demon it's a baby? Demon baby. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Well, we learned a little bit more about Jack this episode too. Yeah. About maybe what he did to his father. Yep. That his mom was mad about last time. Yep, that would have done it. Is this our first, second flashback episode of a character? I think everybody else had one episode, right? Uh, Other than like the intro episodes that had Jack. And yeah. Claire yeah, I guess and so. Or Kate and Charlie, right? More of Jack's backstory. Still waiting to learn about Hurley. Yeah. He's got to have an interesting story. I think so? Yeah. Well, I guess we'll find out. Who do you think's next? we got one more episode we're watching tonight. Um, Kate? More Kate? You think we'll learn more? I, maybe that's who I want. Yeah. So. <laughs> you want to learn more about Kate? Yeah. All right. Well, should we watch the next episode? Let's do On to the next episode. What are these little berry apple thingamajigs? It's not how apples grow. What's that big that grows on a vine? Dingleberry? Ah, yes, that's what it is, a dingleberry. Are they collecting women? That's what we're, we're supposed to refer to these others as, right? They... <laughs> Busting my damn knee. Talking me now? Stalking you? I was protecting you. From what? Southern perverts? <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course. I don't need protecting. I can take care of myself. Me cage. Me throw rocks. What, you smell blood on the wind? You don't hear that? Yeah, waterfall. <laughs> Well, hello, beautiful. He shouldn't get into the water with that wound. Just asking for an infection. Why is that a thing? Why is that always a thing that people do? Dunking? I, it's so stupid. I've never dunked you. Maybe we should try it sometime. It's <laughs> a reason I never get in water. I don't want that to happen to me. Dunking? No me thanks. You? I can't breathe underwater. What if there was, like, a giant sea monster in there? Right? A Nessie? Some sort of weird water creature? Ooh, or two dead bodies! Yeah, what if there were dead bodies in there? Oh, yikes. Who are they? I don't know, it's kind of peaceful that they would die like that together. Holding each other? Yeah. yeah. I want to go check them out. Check them out for what? See what they got on? Fire! Frank. You gonna steal their wallets. <gasps> hey, got myself a wallet. <laughs> You're disgusting. You ain't gonna miss it. What are you gonna use it for, you dipstick? Oh, I'm disgusting, but you're not. It's mine. I'm good for them for holding their breath for that long, man. Put me in there, it'd be like two seconds. You wouldn't mind if I just... I don't care. Something you want to tell me about this little suitcase breakfast? Don't you want him to open it now? <laughs> no, don't really care. I thought you wanted a little more, a little more about her. Though. Is the briefcase really going to enlighten us that much about it? I guess the beachers are going to have to move up now. This can't be normal. The tide shifting so suddenly, rising in so short a time. It's a lot not normal around here. It's like the freaking Hunger Games, right? Like somebody's controlling all of this. Okay, then what about the papers that you took from Marie? There are these notes in French accompanying some of the maps and diagram. If I could translate them, I might be able to make sense of it, but... You and Locke have been leaving before sunrise and coming back after dark for the last four days. What are you doing out there? Is he your new boyfriend? <laughs> I'm trying to contribute something. You're just... You're useless. She can maybe help translate the maps, obviously. Okay, Miss Ryan, if you'll just give me some ID, we'll yes. get some... <laughs> right. <Guess> Nailed it. <laughs> Take a look. Uh, pictures of old theaters in small towns. Oh, there's a fantastic one down in Rio Doso. You can't miss it. It's right off the main road. What, she Mark. is Sawyer, a con man? Mark. Everyone down on the ground! Down on the ground! Now. 
bank robber. All right, girlie, get up and get over there. Let's go, move. Stay there, right there. Get down on the floor. Don't look at me. Look at the floor. Down, right now. I said down. Down. All right. I mean, what's her deal? Was she involved in that? That would make her very wanted. Get off of me. Golly, hate to make her bad position, sweetheart. I think you're the one on top. Maybe you're not here for the case at all. Okay. You wanted to play rough. All you had to do was say so. Give it to me. No. He's such an asshole. <laughs> Look how much you hate him. You're the only person on this island who speaks French. I barely speak French. Please. Barely is better than nothing. What's he trying to do? <laughs> Pick the lock on a Halliburton. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> when everybody just happens to know about Halliburton case. Always the best. Did anybody see you take it? No. I don't think so. Well, which is it? <laughs> Sorry? No, or I don't think so. There's Rose. Hello, Charlie. You think you're the only one on this island that's got something to be sad about? Baby, I got sob stories for you, so why don't you grab the other end of this thing and help me? Well? Yeah, might as well. Come on! Bounces back and hits him in the face. Hey! Don't even think about it. Hey! Damn it! Hell, Freckles. Knew you wanted it. Just didn't know how bad. Oh, you're gonna have to come up with a new move. God! But it's so effective. I want that key. I can take him. The tall guy is not watching us, I don't think. It's now or never. I don't know how to use a gun. <laughs> it's classic. Well, Bonnie and Clyde sort of situation here. Yeah, because I'm sure they have so much time during a bank heist, right? You never said anything about math. You worry about the French, I'll take care of the math. It would be funny if she was like a math genius, right? <laughs> <laughs> Where did you learn to speak French? I knew this guy. This guy? In France, in Central Pay. Kind of lived there for a while. Well, they say that is the best way to learn a foreign language. Is he flirting with her a little? Jack? We got a problem. We have a problem, or... You have a problem. Jack. You're the only one who knows about me. That's not true. Hurley knows, too. <laughs> <laughs> but the case, they made him check it. What was in the case? Four nine millimeters with a few boxes of ammo. Guns. If you had to check the case, how was it under the seat of that? Couple? I know where the key is. The marshal kept it in his wallet, in his back pocket. <sighs> I buried him, Gabe. I know. Well, are you sure Sawyer didn't steal it first? Because that's kind of his MO, stealing <laughs> dead people. If you want my help, we're going to open the case together. What's this I don't trust her all of a sudden sort of situation? Like, why does it. Why does he care? He wants to know what she did. You and your details, Maggie. <sighs> Maggie. Hey, you're old. No, please don't. Shut up. <coughs> Good choice. Unearthing a dead body. Hmm. 
There's something about this that is so familiar. You've been telling me what sounds very much like nonsense for the past hour, and <laughs> now it seems familiar. Okay, A. It's like a song. I told or you that my French sucks. <laughs> this was a mistake. Maybe it's like landmarks. It's landmarks of some kind. She tell you what's inside? Yeah, me neither. I know you think you're doing her a favor, but however she talked you into doing this, she lied, brother. So they both know that she just lies about sh but so does he, so. Well, a liar knows a liar. Con man knows a con man. Pick this vault. This whole thing is the girl's idea. He's gonna kill him. I need the key to safety deposit box 815 now. Who are you? The key to the box now. You need two keys to the banks. Anything you want to tell me? Belong to the man I Stop loved. Stop lying to me. Not. Tell me the truth. Belong to the man I killed. <laughs> All that effort for a toy plane. Sawyer would have just given that to her. Probably. Well, no, he probably wouldn't have because he's. A but it's a fine line between denial and faith. It's much better on my side. <laughs> Okay. Baby, I'm not the one that can help you. Heavenly Father, we thank you. We thank you for those notations, their song lyrics, and your French woman. I told you their song lyrics. The same as the song, song box. <laughs> what? Kate's story just brought more questions about what her story is, right? Like, it didn't actually answer anything. Kind of found out what she did against the law, though. She robbed a bank to get to that safety deposit box. Yes, but was he after her because she robbed the bank, or was she he after her because she killed her husband? Or killed the man she loved, you know? Like, I don't Just not putting it together. <laughs> What's with the, the song lyrics there? Best I can think is it's the same song that played in her music box. The music box? And she was, her just, music box broke, so yeah. she was just trying to... Recite it. Remember, remember the song. It. She wasn't using that to make map notes. notations. Notes. She was just scribbling down notes. Yeah. Notes, you know. Claire's still missing. What do you think is going on there? I don't know. I'm worried about her though, because she's gonna be having a baby yeah, if not like already had days, a like, baby. Yeah. Right. So she was a week or two from her due date. Yeah. So she's a ticking time bomb, and we haven't seen her. They clearly want her because she's a ticking time bomb of yeah. sorts. So. Yeah. I'm worried about what they're going to do with that baby once yeah. it comes out. All right. Well, what about uh, what Locke and Boone are digging up? It, they didn't really show much, no, but they sure they've been didn't. working on it every day. Day, day to day. Yeah, yeah they, I'm annoyed that they didn't show us any of that progress. But I would imagine they're trying to get into this metal crate or yeah. whatever it is. It's a bunker or just to dig through the metal to yeah. see what's happening. All right. So what happens next? What do you, you think is going to happen next? Your guess is as good as mine. Well, your guess would be way better than mine because you've seen this. <laughs> I know what happens. I just can't remember the order of it all. Yeah, no, I have no idea what's going to happen. Again. Glad Charlie found a little bit of his, got his yeah. faith back, it looks like, or he's on the yeah, way to Rose getting his faith him, back. You know, ask somebody for help. Yeah. Yeah, glad Rose showed back up. Mm -hmm. I liked her. Yeah. 
She still thinks her husband's out there. Like she said, yeah. fine line between faith and delusion, right? Mm-hmm. All right, so uh, you guessed right on in between episodes who was the next episode was going to be about. Who do you think the next one's... Who, who do you think we're going to see next? Maybe uh, the brother and sister. Boone and Chin. Could be. Yeah. All right. They're about due. We don't know anything about them. Yeah. The the dad and his son, they're about due for... Walt and Michael. Yep. yep. What should people comment about? Uh, would Sawyer have given Kate the little trinket? Yeah, what do you guys think? Do you think if... Uh, Sawyer had opened up the, the suitcase. He would have given Kate her belongings right. without question. I'm sure he would have asked questions, though. What Kate. do you think? Let us know in the comments. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he would have been a now about it. Also, I guess, at this point, who do you want Kate to go after? There's kind of some uh, flames here and there between Kate and Sawyer and Kate and Jack. Kate and Jack have been going for their part. Jack's not a fan of the lying that she does, so... Yeah. I don't know. Still got a little bit of chemistry there, though. Let's yeah. know in the comments. Comment. Yeah. Also, go ahead and... Thumbs it up. Give it a little thumbs up down Hit that there. subscribe button. Looks just like it, right? Mm-hmm. Just like it. Click it. All right. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our Lost episodes, as well as all of our videos released on YouTube a week before they hit YouTube, as well as full-length commentaries and more. Links down below. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.